Hello, and welcome back to the Temple of Elemental Evil. Let's uh, head into the final right mode. Okay, and we're immediately greeted by a scenic vista of uh, molten fire and brimstone. And once again, we're just going to run up uh, straight for the final boss. And before we get there, we're greeted by old friends, uh, salamanders and the wonderful fireballs that they can throw into a party. Um, there should be a few more up here, so what we want to do before we uh, run everybody into melee, let's get Inera up. Let's get Inera up here. Of course. And get her to cast uh, Cone of Cold. Right away. And yeah, okay, okay. Oh, and it just reaches them. All right, perfect. Okay, and they should take uh, double damage. Okay, yeah, this one's already near death. So let's get Corin to charge okay. in, and hopefully he'll be able to finish it. Yeah. Um, let's run. Let's try to spread everyone out a bit. Let's run in Velios. Uh, here. Right away. Catriona, let's just run her up as far as she can I'm go. Up. Okay, Lucian can uh, run up here. Actually, let's run him over here. Will do. Okay, and then the firemander, uh, fire uh, salamanders get to take their turn. Okay, here comes one. Okay, uh, Inera, yeah, okay, spreading out wasn't too bad an idea. Inera, uh, was the only one that got hit. Okay, let's run her up right and try the same thing again. If you insist. Okay, god, that just misses everyone. Okay, there's another one that's dead, and hopefully they can finish him off yes, before he gets another chance to, uh, throw a fireball. Let's just get everyone to charge in. Okay, and oh, she probably won't I'm be off. able to finish it, but maybe. Okay, yeah, she does. Great. Um, Alright, let's gather up. Let's get Ivelios to um, cast a quick heal on yes, sir. Inera. That should be good. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, and, uh, moving up a bit, go up this imposing ramp. I don't know if these are supposed to be rivulets of, uh, lava or whatnot, but hopefully the, uh, party members are stepping over them. Uh, they're, they're, they're gonna get scorched enough in a minute. They don't need, uh, these little bothers. All right, let's run up. We don't want to engage the boss just yet, but we should be able to get him in sight, yeah. And the final boss here is a Balor, which is a, a demon, I guess, based on the uh, Tolkien's Balrog. Um, anyway, for <laughs> for this fight, um, I'm I'm going to have to buff up. This is by far the uh, the course. most difficult. It can be the most difficult fight in the game. Uh, so I'm going to put stone sure. skin on everybody who's going to be in melee, which is basically everyone except right away. Inera. So let's get that on of course. Lucian. Okay, uh, Inera can go ahead and cast Mirror Image on herself. Right away. And uh, Lucian's going to do some buffing too, so let's go ahead and equip his bow so his shield doesn't have a chance to cause a miscast um, while he's casting buff. So let's get him to cast Mirror I'm Image. Off. All right, um, let's get Ivelios to cast Bless. As you wish. We're going to need every combat buff that we can get because uh, <laughs> even the fighters are going, and even when fully buffed, they're going to have a difficult time hitting this guy. His his armor class is, is really, really high, if I remember correctly. All right, let's also get him to cast... Uh, let's get him to cast prayer. Of course. No, I'm going to cast it so it's out of range of the enemy so we don't engage them. Let's get Lucian to go ahead and inspire courage. Okay. 
And he can also cast Good Hope. Uh, here we go. Good Hope. All right, let's have him cast uh, Heroism on the two fighters before he does that. Okay. I hope those stack. <laughs> okay, and then he can buff everyone with Good Hope. Right away. Okay. Let's go ahead and switch him back to melee. And then the last thing that we want to do is have Evelios cast right Protection away. from Evil on everyone. And this is going to right away. protect against mind spells that the, uh, okay. that the Balor cast, like Charm Person and Suggestion. Yes, sir. And that will give us, that will greatly increase our chances of uh, right surviving. Away. All right, and spells are already starting to expire, so let's go ahead and run in. Okay, uh, what have we here? A young lady? He's not voiced. Um, who are you? I am the Lord of Darkness. Okay, and he's trying to be suave. My dear sweet lady, original name, Lord of Darkness. Um, I guess he could have said Prince of Darkness. Uh, prepare to die, Lord. Are you so eager to fight me? Yeah, actually, yeah. So be it. Let our conflict be swift and full of pain. It probably will be. I don't know about the swift part, but it certainly will be full of pain. And he doesn't... He's not accompanied by uh, fire elementals. He's accompanied by Ifriti. All right, let's get Lucian to cast Charm Monster Okay. on one of the Ifriti. Okay, so... Oh, did he... Uh, resist? Yeah, he made a save. Okay. Um, we want to get Inera to go ahead and hasten okay. everyone. Okay. And then everyone's going to be on the boss. The, uh, probably the fighters are the only ones who will be able to hit him. Uh, so... <laughs> right away. Okay, that doesn't matter. Just run right in. Okay, damn. He got through, and that's with stone skin up. <laughs> oh god, alright, um, let's cast, uh, let's put defensive casting on, and we want to cast Cure Critical Wounds on Catriana. Please do not miscast. Alright, thank you. Uh, Lucian, um, let's try Charm Monster again. Might as well. Will do. Okay. Saving throw failed. Good. And let's uh, run him just outside of the uh, I'm off. demon's range. Okay, Inera, um, let's run her all the way down here. Yeah. Let's run her all the way over here. Of course. And have her try to cast Cone of Cold, and maybe Not she can punch through the uh, Balor's resistance. Okay, no. But she did a bit of damage to the Ifrit. There okay. comes another crit. That's very helpful. Okay, what does the Balor do? Something. Okay, Catriana. I'm off. She whiffs three times in a row. Um. Let's go ahead and defensive casting should still be on. Yeah. Let's get um, Yeah, let's get Evelios to cast cure monitor okay. wounds. I wanna have both of the tanks pretty much topped off. Okay, and take off defensive casting. Um Actually, let's let Inera go first and cast Cone of Cold right again. Okay, she can't get through. Okay, but she takes care of the one of the Freedy, so that's good. Um, and we'll just run her down a bit. Okay. Okay. Lucian, uh, let's get him to. Hmm. 
Let's get him to delay for a sec. And let's get Corrin. Okay. Attacking the Balor again. Okay. What is he at? Is he injured? Okay, Catriona. Okay. Okay, gets a couple of hits in. Um. Let's get Lucian to cast Greater Invisibility on right himself. Away. No, on. <laughs> Damn it. I mistargeted that. Okay, that was pretty stupid. Now Ivelios is invisible. Alright, um. Let's get. Lucian to run around. Of course. Oh. What did I... Okay, God, I'm an idiot. Alright, run back here. <laughs> As you wish. Okay, that was a mistake. Uh, Ivelios, I can guarantee he won't be able to hit the Balor, so let's just keep him behind the tanks, ready to heal if they need it. Okay, he's, uh... The Efreet is, uh... I think the singular of Efreeti is just Efreet. Anyway, he's running over here begging for mercy. Um, I'm not sure if he's begging the Balor or us for mercy. I guess it doesn't really matter. Let's see if Inera can okay. hit the Balor with... Uh, yeah, she gets through with a magic missile. She, oh, she got all five through. All right. Okay, Corin. Yes, sir. All right. 196 and counting. Here comes Slay Living. Okay, he made his save. That was incredibly lucky. I'm off. Okay, this is close. Um, let's get Lucian to cast Cure Moderate Wounds yes, on Corrin. Thought I put on cast. Okay, he had to move into range. That's why. Um. No. Okay, he doesn't have to do anything yet. Let's uh, throw more magic missiles at him. Right if Avelius tried to attack, he would just miss. I can, I can guarantee it. The only way he can hit is with a natural 20 as a roll on his attack. Okay, please finish this. Right away. Okay, that's it. And there's the gem. So let's get that... That could have gone much, much worse. Let's go ahead and loot the gem. If you insist. Okay, it's now, uh... It's now in the crown on the skull, and with this one, we are able to cast Flame Strike, summon Fire Elemental, and we can also summon one of these damn Balors, but uh, we're not going to want to do that because of the habit that they have of casting uh, mind-affecting spells like Fear. All right, let's get our friend the Freet. No, nope, he's he's not. He must be. He must have been feared. Anyway, okay, we'll go to him. Okay, let's just get the fighters up next to him and initiate combat. Uh, okay. I'm off. Okay. Okay. Okay, he's. Oh, does she get enough? No. Okay, he gets an attack. And Corrin should be able to finish him off. Yes, yeah, alright. Alright. That's it for the fire node. We're done with all four nodes. It's time to head for the final boss. Yes, so we're on the other side of uh, where we departed. And this... This corridor looks like it has... It's uh, just carpeted in blood. Um... Anyway, we're going to head down here now. So when we return, there should be a secret door that's open down here that leads to the final boss. So um, we'll be down here and we'll go to the final boss's lair. So as always, thank you for watching and please stay tuned.